under the patronage of His Highness the Emir Sheikh Subah Al Ahmed Al Jaber Al Subah, with His Highness the Deputy Emir and Crown Prince Sheikh Nawaf Al Ahmed Al Jaber Al Subah's attendance, Kuwait Housing Conference opened at Kuwait Sheraton Hotel today. His Highness the Deputy Emir and Crown Prince was received upon arrival by His Excellency the National Assembly Speaker Marzouk Ali Al Ghanim and Chairman of the Committee of Housing Affairs Faisal Mohammed Al Kindri and committee members. The opening ceremony was also attended by the former National Assembly Speaker Jassim Mohammed Al Khrafi, Senior Sheikhs, His Highness Sheikh Nasser Mohammed Al Ahmed Al Subah, His Highness Sheikh Jabir Al Mubarak Al Hamad Al Subah, the Prime Minister, and senior government officials. The opening session started with the national anthem and a recitation from the Holy Quran, after which a documentary film was shown about the housing problem in Kuwait. The National Assembly Speaker delivered the opening speech saying there was great attendance, attention rather, on all levels to work out practical solutions to the housing problem starting from the higher political leadership and down to the ordinary citizens who are directly affected by this issue. Mr. Al Ghanim said we expect this conference to bring about a comprehensive document by which the parliament and the government will be guided in their attempts to work out an ultimate and realistic solution to the housing problem. The UN Assistant Secretary General and Director of the Habitat Executive Program, Dr. John Kloss, also spoke at the opening session to emphasize the importance of the housing issue in the comprehensive economic and social development. He also underscored the importance of planning, financing and technology in working out a solution to the housing problem not only in Kuwait but also at the international level. Chairman of the Real Estate Union, head of the organizing committee, Tawfi Ahmed Jarrah, praised the National Assembly for, his, for its adoption of the housing problem and giving it due priority when the housing adopted legislations based on technical foundations and approved realistic and implementable laws. Mr. Jarrah said the conference was trying to bring about specific achievements which may pave the way for an ultimate solution to the housing problem. He added that the conference will submit to the National Assembly and the Council of Ministers a roadmap intended to bring about a solution to the housing issue.